spotlight tonight. We got a little business matter to take care of right here. Before <laughs> the World Series started, we had on two business owners from Philadelphia and New York who made a wager on the outcome of the World Series. I'll tell you what, we lose, I'll personally bring down cheesesteaks to you, Sal. We win, you got to take a trip to Philly, and you got to bring me some dinner. You got it, my friend. Well, the Yankees won. As you probably know, it's time to settle up. Joining us now are Philly's own Tony Luke Jr. of Tony Luke's Cheesesteaks and New York's Sal Scognamillo of Patsy's Italian Restaurant. It's a happy day for you, not only because the Yankees won, but because this guy's a man of his word. And look what he brought you. Can we get wow, a shot of this? I'll tell you, this is one of the most beautiful cheesesteaks, certainly the biggest I've ever seen. In honor of you, Sal, I brought down the cheesesteak that beat Bobby Flay and the throw down the cheesesteak Italian. Thank you. Thank you very wow. much. I'm, Pleasure to I'm meet just you, as excited to eat this as what the Yankees want. I have to tell you, this, to me, this is the best part of it. Now, not to be outdone, Tony, oh. by the way, Sal brought some of his uh, special dishes here. Of course, we got our meatballs. What is this, lasagna here? Chicken parmesan. Chicken parmesan. Raviolis. Raviolis. And, of Napoleon course, for dessert, cannolis. Napoleon I mean, cannoli. Can't be a sore loser. i got to take care of my friend here. Now, so. wasn't it good for both of your businesses? I mean, the, the, this World Series, it must have been great for both of you. First, the, the Loser, Philadelphia. It's a loser. Oh, oh, it's still so I hard. Gotta, it's still so hard to take it. <laughs> At least as far as the World Series, you're a winner to get uh, there, no um, doubt. No, it, it was great for business. I mean, sports in general in Philly, the fans are very passionate. Um, and uh, they come out, they support, they're hungry. They we, want we to got eat. to mention, uh, you, I mean, your stand is in the ballpark. I mean, you are, you are united with the team in a very special way. Yes, and the stand, I mean, we, we hit record numbers. Um, uh, the New York guys, they, you know, they, they love the cheesesteak, which you is great. get folks with a New York Yankees hat yeah, buying your Yeah, you know, we had them in there. They even <laughs> came down to our, our place in South Philly. Had to make sure we huddled them in, protected them to get them out <laughs> safe. Well, Sal, why can't you call the Stein? You know the Steinbrenners. You need a, you need your own little stand in Yankee Stadium. Believe me, I'm always working on it. I'm always working <laughs> on it. It'd be it. great to see. You in fact, understand. this is a great compliment to Philadelphia and your cheesesteaks is that you used I don't know if we, the new stadium has it, but the old stadium used to have a special place to get Philadelphia cheesesteaks. Yes, absolutely. I mean, look, like, like Tony said, it is becoming America's uh, best sandwich. It's excellent stuff. I enjoy it. He's... He's wonderful. I feel like I know this guy forever. I tell you, I'm just as excited to eat this cheesesteak and to meet Tony It's, it's a, as, as much as the Yankees win. And as a matter of fact, I want to give him one of my Patsy's cookbooks. Uh, I'm just, I'm well, give it over well, you are a great salesman, so, Sal. Well, you know what? I, you know what? I don't want to ever be like, a, you know, like they say, sore loser. I'm not a sore winner. I'm happy we won. But this guy's well, a wonderful guy. Well, and you've got to recognize, by made, the way, that the, Tony, that, that the Phillies, Tony, were the, they were the world champions coming into this. And it was fact. a lot they closer. They made it to the World Series. It was a lot closer than a lot, closer than a lot of than Yankees fans thought would it would be. Say, yeah. Of course, it didn't go to the full seven, but... But they, they gave them a run for their money. They did. And I have to tell you, it, it could have tipped either way. I, I am, of course, happy the Yankees. By the way, does it bring business into, into Patsy's oh, to, to win the World Series? Absolutely. We get a lot of people before and after. Uh, Joe West, the umpire, the head umpire, was in actually for lunch. Did you case. ask him about I any of his questionable calls? I don't want to go to jail, so I didn't ask him anything <laughs> at all about anything. I just said, how are you doing today? That's about yeah. it. Yeah, but by the way, highlights of the series? Lee, I mean, he yeah. was, you know, he, he, he was amazing. And great I got to, I got to tell you, uh, you know, our guys struggle to hit, but they're great guys, you know, and it happens, you know, people, it, it's not like they didn't try. It's not like they didn't come out there every day wanting to do the best. And I give them credit. They, they got a lot of heart. There's a lot of talent there. But things worked out, you know, the other way. But you know, there's usually, always next year. Usually I love this show and I, I want to be in it for, for my entire uh, experience at, at, at work. But I want this show to be over so I can eat this thing. <laughs> you better watch your hands because these guys will grab it pretty yeah, quick. Yeah, I know. <laughs> our crew is dying for it. And by the way, this whole segment is a result of Pedro, our cameraman here. So thank you, Pedro. He definitely Thanks, guys. Close. You are a man of your word.